What's up everybody? Border here, welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm gonna try to do front 350. That'll complete all my 360 onto 50s. I technically have done all 360s to nose presses, but I was spinning off the ends at, you know, different amounts. So it's kind of hard to say I've got them down, but let's get the final piece to having all 360s to 50s, which is front side. Uh. I had some pretty flamboyant arms on that one. It's rugging it up. Ugh. Now that I'm trying this to into a 5.0, what I'm noticing is I, when I do a front three on, I, I rely on like the part of the spin where I like dip like this. So I need to like find a way to dip like that and then put my tail down because it's very front foot heavy in my head. When I go for the press, I'm like spinning a front three front foot heavy, but then trying to change it to my back foot. So I kind of like land in a 270 because of that. So, mm. So same issue, I kind of landed in front two. Let's throw the three a little harder, catch the inside a bit. If I could kind of do front three, five oh front three, I'd be stoked. So from this point on, I, uh, I realized a mistake I made. I, this was all filmed in one clip, but at some point I reset the mic and I never actually remember doing that. So the, uh, and then when I downloaded the mic audio, I saved the good one, which was like 50 minutes or something like that and deleted the other two. Cause I assumed they were just like accidental start stop type situations. And the the last one out of the three was the rest of this video, and I didn't even realize it. So yeah, there's no audio. Um, anyways, one thing I wanted to say was that uh, um, Anthony brought up brought up you know like how do I just start trying front threes on and like not feel like scared or anything like that. And one thing I said that I think is kind of useful information is that. Uh, I was saying, you know, one thing that really helps with me just chucking the front three on is the fact that I was starting out my session, well, kind of starting out my session with that switch backside 180. And that switch backside 180 is the second half of a front three on. So all I'm doing is a front 180 to a switch back 180. And, uh, yeah, it just helps with your mindset if you break tricks down that way. And, you know, I thought that's some useful information I could, you know, slap in the end of this video. And then, yeah. Um, and then right after that, or somewhere after that, um, you know, I was able to get the front three, five oh front three. And, uh, other than that, you know, it was a sweet session. I'm stoked on how it went. And other than me forgetting to save that last bit of audio, I'm stoked on this session. So, yeah. Um, anyways, thank you all for watching and keep doing your best. See you in the next one. Have a good one. Do your best. Peace.